a partnership with communities across the Midlands to improve what they describe as gateways into the city is now underway. The Gateway Project will focus on beautification efforts to eight corridors in the Columbia area, starting with Airport Boulevard from I-26 towards the airport. WIS reporter Naomi Popa joins us live on Airport Boulevard to tell us more about what needs to be done to that corridor and Naomi, what we can expect for the seven other projects. Judy, Hannah, lots to be done here on Airport Boulevard. City of Casey Mayor Elise Parton tells me it takes priority because it's needed the most. And to go a little bit off script here, I just met someone who's visiting Columbia, staying at this hotel right here. Tells me he's actually shocked by the appearance and, I, I mean, the look of this road. If you fly in or out of the Columbia Metropolitan Airport, you'll most likely drive down Airport Boulevard, a roughly mile long strip that Casey Mayor Elise Parton tells me needs some work. She says the corridor sees lots of traffic every day and beautification efforts would greatly impact its appearance and welcoming atmosphere. You know, people do fly in here from all over the world to go to Fort Jackson, to go to the university, to go to our great businesses. Um, but they also drive in through here and go up to the airport. So we just want people to know that when they've reached this region, they ne they know that they've hit a good place. As for what will be done here on Airport Boulevard, Parton says irrigation, landscaping and signage are needed. The city has already planned for the project and obtained the necessary permits from the South Carolina Department of Transportation. All that's left is to set the project out for bid, which will be done within the next 30 days. All of this is meant to create a place that people want to come and stay and, you know, sleep and eat and spend money and enjoy, um, but also the same for businesses to come on this really important corridor. Airport Boulevard is one of eight in the pipeline. Each will get similar upgrades. Mayor Parton says the funding for each of the projects will come from a partnership with each municipality and their counties to pay for the respective gateways and for continued maintenance on the projects. After Airport Boulevard, the Fort Jackson Gateway at I-77 and Forest Drive is next. Mayor Parton tells me she's confident this project will take root in the fall. Reporting in Lexington County, I'm Naomi Popa, WIS News 10.